Hi, I'm Jane Remaker from the DocuShare Business Unit Group, and I'm here to talk to you today about DocuShare, Xerox is offering in the document and content management space. We like to call it essential content management for the enterprise. And I'm going to show you how easy the software is to use and how it can benefit you and your organization. Now we've all had the challenge of trying to find misplaced or lost information. What I'm going to do is show you how you can get around that. Now Gartner says that your typical office worker spends 30 to 40 percent of their time just looking for information. It doesn't matter if it's lost, misplaced, or misfiled. The problem with your company is the cost of reproducing or possibly even re-engineering that information. It could be very costly and detrimental. Another problem that we see today is what we call collaboration by email. You know, where you're working on a project with you and your team and you start sending out really large files around on email and everybody starts to send more versions and their revised version and before you know it, not only are you clogging up your email servers, but everybody's email box is full. There's a better way to handle that information and DocuShare can show you how. Here we are at DocuShare's homepage and as you can see in the upper left hand corner, I'm currently log in, logged in as a guest which means I can see unrestricted information, information that the whole company can see. Next, I'm going to log in so that I can start adding information into the system. You'll immediately notice that there's another file folder that shows up in this list, which is sales and information and marketing. This information was restricted from general users, but I'm allowed to see it. What we're going to do is to add a collection so that we can start adding our information. It's as simple as coming right to here where it says Add, Drop Down, Collection. I'm going to give it a title. I'm going to call it Records 06 and hit Apply. And just like that, we have now started to add information into DocuShare. Next, I'm going to come over here to Permissions and see who has the ability to see this file folder, have the ability to add information or modify, as well as manage. I'm going to come right here to it says change access list and I'm going to add on my friend Bry and my team member Mark and hit update. Now all of us can be able to add information into this file folder as well as work on different information and make adjustments as needed. Next thing we want to do is add information into that collection. Again we come to where it says add document and here I'll be able to browse not only my desktop but any of my shared drives that I have. I'm going to come into my file folder and pull in some information that I previously had been working on. I'm going to call this project research and hit apply. As you can see it was easy as that with those simple few steps to start adding information and start working with my team members. Now that I have my documents in here, I can easily take this URL and send it out in an email to all of my coworkers, Mark and Bry, and anybody else who, can access, who I want to give access to so that we can all start working together. But let's say it's six months from now and I can't remember what I named the document and as you can see here, I gave it such a generic name, I might not be able to find it very easily in the conventional systems that you're used to. With DocuShare, you have full text searching capability. So up here in the upper right hand corner, I'll be able to put in any of the words that I'm looking for. Select the entire site and hit go. What DocuShare is doing is looking through every single Word document, Excel document, even scan documents, PDFs, as long as they're a fully text searchable PDF, I'm looking for the word research. As you can see, I have 20 different matches to my query to be able to slice and dice this information down to exactly what it is. I'll come right here where it says refine query. And from there, you'll be able to see that I can now do a query on not only any word in the document, but any of the metadata that we saved. Where it contains, does not contains, equals, and or not in accrue. I can even do by creation dates, that it's on, after, before, or in between. I'm going to say anything that was created after January 11th. I can select it down on different types of documents that I've saved into the system, maybe specific users, 
and I can even limit my search down to what kind of documents of application that we created it in. I know that what I did was in a Word document, and so I'll select that and hit search. I've now refined that query, so we went from 20 matches down to just one. You can see the power of the search engine within DocuShare to make sure that you find exactly what information you need at the appropriate time. And by the way, it only gives you search results on the information that you're allowed to see. You would not see information that you're restricted from. So there it is. DocuShare really is a powerful tool that can impact your organization, making them more efficient and giving them better access to critical business information that they need to get their jobs done easily and efficiently. And because your information is stored securely online, your mission critical information is secure from loss due to natural disaster, accident, or theft.